Hey, hello guys, Lazy here. I hope you're all feeling well. Today we are playing the first and second chapter of Maze of Bouncy Bear. As to the first one, it has a really simple premise. We got our son lost in a secret maze in a now closed restaurant called Bouncy Bear and Mr. Moon's family dinner, and we are going to search for him. As to our antagonist that we are witnessing on the screen, they are really on the edge of being cute and terrifying as how their little tummy is bunching out and turning their head as if it was out of curiosity makes him really cute that what you wanna protect but those wide open eyes be speaking sanity and also the smile on their face which is rather like a snarl make them terrifying so just let's go. Life is like a roller coaster ride. It has its ups and downs, sometimes it's fast and sometimes it's slow, but it never stops. Exactly one year ago from today, Mike entered the maze. I found the courage to uncover the mystery by myself. What a musty restaurant. It has arcade games too. <laughs> Very enticing. This game has a lot of similarities to Garden of Wamban with the mascots on the wall saying things. Hello, my name is Bouncy Bear. Can you make it out, my mains? And the blood on the floor. It's a gorgeous restaurant. And who are you, Pa? Mr. Monsens. Eat everything if you want me to not eat you. Mr. Mons, it depends on the food quality. If the quality low, I'm not eating everything. Comprehendo. Do we have anything here? We have rules. Do not touch bouncy bear. Do not go in the maze alone. Do not go in the dark. Do not run. As far as I know, I couldn't even run. Even if I push shift as a mad person, I can only walk. I guess we gotta go where that blood stain is coming from. Right, Bouncy Bear? In a wreck? Shee-hoo! Are you saying the same thing here too? If you can't find the exit, hopefully someone will come to help you. <laughs> you, Bouncy Bear! You will come to help me! That's so cute! And keep in your mind, Bouncy Bear, if I met you in a cave, i try to feed you. Ugh. Well, he started going crazy. I love you, by Mike Brown. Mike Brown? Isn't he my son? Such a wonderful land. Look at that. I'm waiting for a witch popping out of those buildings, wanting to eat me. Though. Bouncy Bear's house. Oh, it's just a Bouncy Bear house. And this is Mr. Moon's house. They have jam in the house. They must be good friends. They must have found a similar point in their life. Loving to eat children. Before I'm heading towards there, I want to check out what's here too. I'm not gonna lie. The maze itself looks pretty gorgeous. Slippery, wet floor, liars. Where's that red velvet on the wall? <laughs> the hunt has started. What does it mean? So far, I've been safe. But now, everything changed or what? What is this? Insert pin here. Enter pin. We can't find a pin code? Oh, I'm being haunted. <gasps> Is it the head of my son? Ooh! <laughs> okay, that was loud. I wouldn't feed you. Uh-uh. You took my son's head. You psychopathic piece of motherfucker. What the hell? My world just shattered. But I clearly found my son's head over there. How to survive Bouncy Bear? 
The game this time had it said the hunt was started though. I feel like I'm not being hunted. Where am I? <laughs> ah, the hunt has started. Why now? Why now? <laughs> ah, all of a sudden. Like what did I do that triggered it? <gasps> <sighs> Freak. Freaking bouncy bear dude. I feel him. Oh. There he is. Wait a bit. So he's faster than me. What? What? Oh man. So once you got busted, you just cannot run away from him. He's too fast. Even with him only walking. Decode. Decode. <sighs> Why is there code, Bouncy Bear? Come here to play dance and sing with us. Wait, isn't it 0210? Let's try that. 0210. That sounds reasonable. 0210. Will my code work? 0210. 0 Two, ten. Enter. Yes, I found the code. But that was just the first one. What is this? What is happening? I cannot go further. It's loud as hell. Are you from metal? I wanna, I wanna back. I wanna go back. What's wrong with you, buddy? Mike, I promise you, I'll get my revenge very soon. It has to do with fire. So will I burn down whole place? So in the first you, you got the code, you just gotta enter it, then meeting up with a green bear. He must be related to bouncy bear. And now the game ends. Alright then, let's play the second one. As you can see in the second chapter, Bouncy Bear became something different. He became a Squatch or something like that. And about the game, it's after we found Mike's head and we are re-entering the portal where everything is totally different now. Man, those loud noises when Bouncy Bear got me, the darkness of the abandoned restaurant was suffocating. I'm back. I came with fire and I got much shorter. <laughs> Do you see how short I am? What's happening here, boys? Everything is different now, indeed. Are you a new monster? You were the one who I met. Teddy Maddie says, push this button to save the game. Push it now. What? Saving. I'm saved. Can I have it? Flashlight? How to bring that forth? That was a purple one. That means if we have here a purple door like this, we can open the door with that, right? Yes. And that's our main antagonist in this game, I guess, whose name is Yo-Yo Yati says. Hello kids, my name is Yo-Yo Yati and I am very strong. To prove me that you are strong too, find an exit of the maze. Thank you, Yo-Yo. Thank you for the great advice. I'll push it to the limit this time, Yo-Yo. I'm not only find out my way, but I'm also gonna burn down this whole building this whole abomination that way you liar what the hell no i can't go this way okay officially that wall is a liar <laughs> what about rip this off from the wall no oh, it's boarded too well hmm yo yo I haven't found here anything. I guess I should find another key. 
We can't jump either. Wow. It's a real improvement over the first game, I gotta tell you. We can run, we can also jump, and we become really short, like most critical. <laughs> jump on the ball. We are in Harry Potter now. Eh. On the nine and a half section. I didn't find anything, yo yo, here. It's a really cringy room. Ah, yo yo. In dire situation, where is our friendship? You only needed me when I was rich and young. But now that I am stuck and getting old, all of the friendship is gone. What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> and from friendship we became enemies. That was terrifying. Is he here? Oh, he must be here somewhere. Frick. Oh, he's there. Frick. Ah, oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. But I can run. I can run at least. Have you taken a shower today? You gotta brush your teeth, dude. Go bed. Go into bed. Oh, man. Oh, no. He's on my neck. <laughs> I just saved my run, my stamina for that big guy. I'm not even gonna run until I met him. He's really big and really fast. And he hasn't taken a shower for days. I, I can smell him from far away. Where is he? Is he- oh, I, I cannot believe it, dude. Like, come on. Okay, I'm done. Wait, I lost him. Cool. He didn't like that section. Uh, bouncy, honey. Yo, yo. There's a button. We can push a button. Cool. And there's a key too. Push the button. Save. Very cool. Now I just... Gotta find my way out somehow. It's gonna be really tough. Am I... Am I hearing... <gasps> oh, frick. <laughs> I, f I thought the mural was the freaking monster. My heart will stop if by going back I'm gonna meet them. No, we are back. We are back here. I can't believe it. What are you saying? Do you want to know the secret to become strong like me? Here it is. Work out 35 hours per day. I've already done that, but I'm still not so strong as you. Liar. Double liar. Dad. Oh no. Okay, we gotta trick him somehow. Oh, he's guarding the entrance. No! Come on. Show me mercy. Just this one time. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Wait, why doesn't he like this section? <gasps> Oh no! There's the monster stuck on the wall. Congratulations. Dummy dummy. Okay. Yes. I think I found it. <gasps> Yo! Thanks God. Let me out. Immediately. For freak's sake. Let me save too. Oh yes. Yes. <laughs> So what did I get this stuff only? The blue one. The blue one. And now we got the bird. Yes. Hi, I'm Otto, the cleaner robot. I make the restaurant clean and shiny every day. Well, Otto, you're just as sexy as Opila bird. You must be related to her. Safe? For no reason whatsoever. So what game we have here? 
Hey yo, I need you to do something for me. Find the six missing cupcakes. If you find them, I will give you a prize. Very well. So now it's cupcakes instead of eggs. I mean, six cupcakes in a big building like this? That's a real challenge. I can't wait how loud Mr. Otto can scream in my ears. That's one cupcake, sir. No more cupcakes here. So how about bring the cupcake here? Odo, I have one cupcake, please. Oh, he's not open-minded enough to accept my only cupcake. A hospital? Oh no, it's just a simple restaurant again, in the restaurant. Hello kid, my name is Bams Bear and I'm a leader of the restaurant. We will have a lot of fun together. Especially if you serve my pancakes, sir. I'm a really fussy one. Has to be delicious. Really? No cupcake here? Like how? Man, it's so bright over here as if we were approaching heaven. That makes it two cupcakes. Saving. Rules. Do not go in the maze alone. Do not go in the dark. Do not go in the warehouse. Do not go in the sea. Do not be a child alone in this maze especially. Because we will get rid you of your head. <sighs> warehouse. I'm not supposed to go into the warehouse. Oh, 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 no, no. I'm not supposed to. Oh, Ribi Rubby. Come on. What the hell? Go back to your place. Clean up the place as you are supposed to, dude. Man, Otto Bird looks like a penguin. <laughs> How did you reach me? You're so freaking short. Oh no. Oh no. And every time you gotta recollect the cakes too? That'll be a headache. I suggest then starting with the really hard one. With this one, I guess, right? Oh no. There must be a cupcake here too! No, please. You're sexy. Oh no, I so swear! Oh, the oldie pancake. I've joined the family several times by getting eaten by you. I joined the big family of pooped out restaurant guests. What was that? Just go away, please. Nobody needs you here. I gotta plan my route. This time I'ma go to the right where the Freaking bird went this time. <gasps> oh, boy. No. Please. God damn you. I saw my cupcake. Please. I saw my cupcake. I swear. It was here somewhere. There it is. It's in the cupcake. Oh, no. We are so close, but so far away. Here it is. Now I just just gotta find my way. No, I'm fucked. They are so rude. It's either in a dead end, that freaking pancake or cupcake. Somewhere around here. Yep, there we got our precious cupcake. Yep, this time I was much faster. Can we go like out here? Yes, actually, we can almost. Oh, you motherfucker. He's coming right towards me. Okay. At least I know where the pancake is, or the cupcake, so it's kinda like easier for me to find it. Motherfucker, dude. I know. Hey, why didn't he catch me? <laughs> oh, I have already unplugged my earplugs just to not hear that loud voice. And he totally passed me. And now he comes back. Okay, I'm not... I'm, 
Oh man. No birdie 30 for me. Thank you. I skip it this time. Alright. I I would like to skip it this time. Like, god damn it. Okay, maybe now. Maybe now. Maybe now. Please God. Let me get out of here. Yes. 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 Ah. Uh, Yes. Oh man, I'm feeling so exultant. So that's one cupcake out of the picture. The second one. The third one. Look buddy, I got half. Is it okay? Are you satisfied? Not really. Don't tell me that we got like four cupcakes here. Okay, I just looked it up and in the warehouse you can find three of them. Jesus Christ, three of them. Oh my god. And I got only one of them. Where is our bird? There's a, there's a cupcake. I see a cupcake over there. So with that, we need another one. Wait, wait, wait. I see glowing there a cupcake. Oh my god. And how the f to get out? No, 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 I will be very f***ing upset if he gets me. It must be the way out. Right there. Isn't... Yes, that's the way out, please. Gah. Gah. Oh. Oh. I got all three of them from here. So now I got five. The sixth, I just don't know where it is. Maybe five is enough for this bird. Let's see. Ah! Shit. Cupcake! Please show me your. Ah, there it is! It showed itself to me. Bless you, cupcake. Bang! That's my price. A hammer. A hammer? <laughs> what can I do with the hammer? How about breaking the door over there, huh? This one. I wanna break this door. Not. Then what? What can I use this hammer for? Can I break in the stuff room? I wanna get inside. Or how about the boards outside? That I wanted to rip off with my bare hands, but I wasn't strong enough. I'm not a character built out of yo-yo. A strong guy. Was it here? Have I have to face yo-yo again? No. No, not yo-yo again, please. Oh god. God damn you, yo-yo. Hammer, hammer him, hammer him. Oh. And it has another key. Okay, it can easily be, it could easily be, though, a trap. Okay, okay, we can do this. Ah. Oh, we faced our biggest fear and we overcome it. We overcame our biggest fears, dudes. So with that, I've got the yellow one for the staff room. Ricky? Rickety. Dr. Godo's office. Where you can sleep, either. Push. Saving. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Bouncy bear is here again. God damn, I still haven't burned down the building. No! I should go here. Okay, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I don't have stamina. That's a very, very good news. 
Wait, it's the same song, it's the same music that we can hear in Gunner of Bamban too. Do you remember? For the last chase sequence. Wow wow. Wow wow. Okay, I'ma be a good boy here and follow the arrows. Is this Mofo? Yep, still chasing me, but I'm faster. Much faster this time, boy. What? What? There was an arrow! It's terribly loud. Bouncy Bear even gotten more insane than he was. He's going full insane style, dude. Has he printed that on the wall? That misleading arrow? Okay, let's go this way this time. I don't believe anymore in arrows. I don't even believe in their existence anymore. The walls are so shiny. I like them. It is as though as we were in an egg. <laughs> in a big cozy egg. Okay, that was weird. I know. So, this time I gotta go on the right we just have to go to the other direction where the arrow is pointing towards hey slow as hell dude do you even lift wow stars take me wow oh. please embrace me stars what? <laughs> That's bullshit! I was stronger, I was faster, I was smarter than Bouncy Bear. And look what fate I've gotten! We played both chapters of Maze of Bouncy Bear that's out already. I really dig the monsters in this game. There's not too much story to them, obviously. We were just a father who's going to search for his son and we found his head. Then we went back burning down the whole building and we just got chewed on. So I enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it too. When the third chapter will be out, I will be there too. And yeah, see you next time. Bye.